Look at this. It was supposed to be a cloudy week, but it has snowed every day. It's amazing. What's up, guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. I'm just out here enjoying the winter wonderland. As you can see, we got, I'd say, probably another six inches last night after the old toboggan sesh there. So I'm out at the farm and uh, it's time to clean up some cars. I know we should have done this before the snow, but things happen. People get busy. So anyways, today's the day. So I think we got five cars to get out of there that are smashed and ready for the scrapyard. So I'm just gonna let the old tractor warm up here. She's finally fixed. I broke the uh, hydraulics, uh, just the basically the knob, the little thing that holds the knob down. So got that all fixed up, Dan fixed it, and we're good to go. So maybe a little drifting in the truck, I run to the house, grab my sawzall, cut some cats off, and then we'll uh, start cleaning up cars. Look at the snow. Gotta love how she packs in your rims and then your vehicle just vibrates all the way down the highway. All right, let's get after it. Should be snowmobiling today. Back in the garage. Good to have the Maverick back. I got her cleaned up after we rode it. I love washing it in the winter because it's so much easier to clean, especially just getting that salt off there. So I got this thing, just the battery off it. I'm gonna order a new battery for it because that thing is screwed. This is the prototype. I don't know much about it, except it's got a 50 horsepower engine on it and it's a rotary engine, but uh, yeah, that's basically the cluster. And she runs mixed gas. Like, I don't even know what this gauge is for or anything. <laughs> and this is the gas tank. But, uh, yeah, order a new battery. The other shredder will be back Sunday. Obviously, by the time this video is posted, it will be long past Sunday. But we'll have the shredder back. She's good to go. Apparently, the intake was just full of water. Who would have thunk? Everyone's like, carburetor, carburetor. I cleaned the car like 40 times. So, yeah. Anyways, we made some rules for Turtle Island because uh, somehow, I don't know how people are finding out about it. Uh, I heard that Google Maps, people have been looking along the river and finding it, but a lot of people are kind of disrespecting it. We dug uh, the fire pit out for two hours, cleaned everything up. Someone kicked all the rocks in there and uh, people were ripping donuts and you know putting cigarette butts and like candles and stuff and you know, disrespect it. If you want the trails to get closed down, it's gonna happen if you're gonna act like that. just. Go out and enjoy it, right? So all the wood we chopped up, gone. So <laughs> anyways, yeah, that's what uh, that's what happens. So I forgot to show this. I got this yesterday from Nobis. They make really nice coats. So they're Canadian and they're amazing. Look at this parka. Oh, I've never had a red parka or a red coat in general, a full red coat, but... This thing is pretty a fancy. This is the Daniel Vermilion. So I'm excited to test it out. I'm not gonna wear it today though because I'm headed out on the tractor and I would ruin that coat real fast. That's why I'm just gonna wear this, this Carhartt work jacket. Go do some work. All right, let's get after it. Thank you, Nobis. Oh yeah, absolute beauty day out here. Life's easier in a tractor, that's for sure. Oh, a couple people on the trails. Well, there's no snow for it yet, but you gotta do what you gotta do, right? It's funny, the year they put in the trail that goes by the house here, it's only been in here, I don't know, six years or something. I sold my sled the year before. Because <laughs> it basically stopped snowing. I knew it would snow, but it would only snow for, you know, you get a good week, maybe a couple days of decent sled, and you're done. So, if you're not from Ontario, you know now that basically you gotta go three, four hours up north if you want some really good sledding and awesome trails. If you're down here, you might get a good weekend or week, but not much anymore, so. Anyways, made her down the track. Look at all salt. Ty uh, got his fifth wheel out, I can see. Spent $450 on a salt truck to come down here, so <laughs> we got some traction. Let's go uh, clean up those cars. Just look at it, guys. Look at that snow coming down. They're absolutely perfect. I'm glad I live in a part of the world that it does snow. I wonder what life would be without snow if you never got to see it. It's a pretty beautiful thing, but it can be shitty at times, but for the most part, it's pretty amazing. So I'm just trying to use, I was trying to make a phone call. That's why I'm standing on the tire. But uh, yeah, I'll keep uh, 
making a pathway here. Hopefully the guys are here soon to pick up some cars. And uh, yeah, keep at her. I don't know where this guy is. 20 minutes late. Hey, anyway, brought my saws all down. Gotta cut some cats off. It's crazy how much this little thing is worth. Cause it's full of the good stuff, apparently. Yeah, just chopped her off there. Hopefully it's here soon. Good lord, I don't like waiting for people. I don't like when people are late, either. Uh, all right, let's keep at her. Still no show, but Pure Leader is just delivering packages to me now. We got another Princess Auto Special magnetic floor sweeper. So this is for down the track. Sometimes we burn skids and stuff and, you know, nails everywhere, parts falling off cars. So I'll just walk around with this. And uh, I got a nice Amazon Prime package too, a little trickle charger for the shredder. So thank you, Princess Auto. Uh, yeah. Well, Buddy never showed up after calling me every day this week, confirming that today at 11 was the time, so I'm just out here cleaning the driveway for my dad instead. But what are you going to do? Some people. So, better have a good excuse. Anyways, yeah, now a whole lot going on. I'm going to finish this, hit the sauna, get my weekend started. Tomorrow, I think we're test driving a Range Rover. Laura wants to look at that. Then Turtle Island, then birthday in Port Franks, then Sunday, the shredder's coming back. So I think I'm just gonna combine this video into all three days. Why not? It's been a while since I've done that, and uh, yeah, show you guys the full weekend. So I'm gonna finish the snow and go hit the sauna. And new day, happy Saturday. It's Maverick time, looking clean. L Dog, you always look good, eh? Yeah. Rocking the new snow pants. <laughs> We swung by Walmart. It was a good time. Didn't get the cove. So yeah, looks good. Let's go get her dirty. Everything's frozen solid, so hopefully she stays somewhat clean. And uh, yeah, all boys have been down there since uh, 10. It's noon now, and we're headed out. And then uh, Shredder's back tomorrow, so get some footage. Cause some trouble. <laughs> Pulling behind the quad. <laughs> that looks so funny. It jumps. So nice. I can't believe how much snow we got. Look at that. River's not frozen here yet. It's definitely frozen down by the house, though. Get in! <laughs> We're not winning too well with the fire situation. I imagine it just goes right up. <laughs> uh, we're bringing the wood chipper down next time. Just throwing all the little twigs in it.
Thank you, it's a Brad. Is this the first time you're out here? Yeah. This is my first time. Is this your first time? This is my first time. Oh my god. Here. <laughs> oh, this oh, is for me. Oh. oh. Look how deep that is. The people are sick of looking at you though. I know. Jeez, look at this. this oh. Look at this guy. We've only been down here 300 times. I can't even get out. And you know to get out and not go near this hole. The 570. I made it through here in the 570. I was doing so well and I just slipped up. You weren't actually doing that great. <laughs> this is the in the last I 25 seconds we pulled feet. you out twice. I thought I was doing well. <laughs> you look good, <laughs> if that's what you meant. I thought I was gonna stay clean today. <laughs> hey, Polaris for the win. Polaris, the two Polaris are out. I know. Hey, put your brakes on. You're, yeah, what are what? you doing? <laughs> this thing's in neutral over here. No, not yet. It'll be a slow roll. Slow bird. Slow bird. Slow bird. Look at this guy. Big yank, big yank. You should use a tree. It's gonna break my wind. Yeah. There it goes. Come on! What the heck? You, we, you should have used the tree. This guy's so rammy. So now I gotta tie you off to a tree. I'll do one of my uh, boat boat knots. He was asking me to get my new line on. Now he's got. Well, he wants uh, he wants his line back. Okay, hold on. Tied to a tree. Let's do a little quick interview here. In lesson number one, hey. you can't do that with. How do you feel ropes. about your winch being snapped? Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Hey, they make new winch ropes every day. Lesson number two: Let L Dog drive. <laughs> what was that? Let L Dog drive. Apparently. Let L Dog drive. I heard. Let elbows fly. <laughs> that's what I heard. So that's also rule number three. Let elbows fly. <laughs> Put it on the tree. We're going to listen to the medic here. We did this training in school. Look at this guy. A brand new Scott crystal clear lenses. Look at these things. Let's see if this knot, this knot, slow motion. Here it goes. It's slowly. That's a good knot. <laughs> We're good. Oh yeah. It's had four wheel drive any time now. There we go. We're coming. Knots holding. Hey, if you actually had four wheel drive. Well, Can-Ams don't have true four-wheel drive. Not like the Polaris's. Oh, wait. Shot of the day. Shot of the day. Look at this. This little hole is the death of everybody. No one can get through here. Hey, no, it doesn't smell good? That. Hold on a second. Look at your nails. Oh, hey there. Hey, yeah, my hands are screwed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, we got the mud. Found the mud. Okay, bye. Bye.
if you keep your feet up on the front, okay. yeah, you won't get a soaker. It's go. weird. It's physics. Go? You got this. Yeah. We'll winch you out. Break another winch rope. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where we found them. Uh, uh, no, I think he's just a low. Is he? Yeah, I told him to switch to low, so. You want to leave your house across the river? Really? I was like, I'm not across the river. No. <laughs> That's his belt. Wow. For sure. His belt's smoking for sure. Yeah, look at his belt. <laughs> All right, round two. The old boat. <laughs> Why does he go so fast? Like it's the perfect way to get wet. What? Imagine I throw this oh. right over. <laughs> it's right over. Dead on! Oh! As we can't get back through the ice. Hey! No problem for a pro like Chris. <laughs> now his machine's gonna be frozen, frozen solid. solid. <laughs> yeah. oh. Open the back door of the cabin and he pulls in. <laughs> <laughs> Put it right in the cabin. Oh man. Well, it's clean now. And so are you. Mark told me to do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Big. Why is there a motorcycle here? Oh, there we go. I'm surprised your knees bend that good. Good. Gas it. Okay, that's good. <laughs> down Time we saw him. <laughs> she is a windy one out here today. Wow. Anyway, it's Sunday now. Full shift of the weekend. And guess who I got? 
<laughs> She's jacked. She absolutely loves it out here. Hey, bud. Trapped in the back seat for the last hour. So yeah, still debating on sled and new truck. So I've decided I went on Facebook Marketplace. I'm gonna try and shelter the wind. There we go. I went on Facebook Marketplace and typed in 2020 F-150 and there was one on there in Ontario. So I'm gonna wash mine up, take some pictures of it, throw it up there. It is a 2020 Platinum, so I'm sure, you know, people want it. So maybe I can get a little more than what they usually, what it's worth, so. Oh, big pee, big pee. Hey, yeah, so I'm gonna throw it up, see what happens. If nothing happens, then whatever. But uh, yeah, if I can sell it, maybe I'll order a new one. And uh, the nice thing, usually when you order a truck, it takes about eight weeks. Usually it takes eight weeks. This one actually took, I think I got it in four weeks but because they edited an order. They knew I was pissed off because they hit a deer with my old truck. So I was hurting, I want a new one. So, but yeah, we'll see. And then I uh, gotta figure out a sled this week. So, holy frick, it's windy. Let's get this truck washed up. That wind is just howling. What do you think, Nala? Hey? What do you think? Hey, everyone on YouTube loves you. <laughs> Big old hairy butt. This is the wheelie ramp. I gotta paint it. Obviously, I'm in no rush now because it's a freaking blizzard outside. Wait until the snow melts and then we'll get her going again. Nala? God. Hey. Hey, girl. God. Hey. What, are you trapped in there? There you go. The old sled, I'm glad she's running again. What do you think of it? You wanna go for a ride? You wanna go for a ride? The shredder is on its way back. It'll be here in an hour. Then you can chase after me on the shredder. Let's do it. Let's wash that truck in a blizzard. Hey, oh. get that tail. Oh, you cracked me up. Oh, oh, you're so tough. Hey, hey. Oh, there she gone. Oh yeah, great day to fresh wash the truck, eh? Great, Noah. So <laughs> <laughs> chilly. Get her cleaned up. <laughs> That's a clean truck. Oh, she's back at it. She's jacked. Whoop, whoop. Hold on, there. A little swap, a little swap. <laughs> yeah, Nala loves winter and she loves it out here. All right, let's take some pics of this thing and uh, Connor should be here soon with the shredder. Still very bright today. Hi, Viz. I might just start rocking this in all my YouTube videos now. Look at the light in there, huh? Look at that snow drift. Doesn't snow like such a magical thing. Like, look at that. It's like art. No, it's like art. Art, fart, art. No. Okay. All right, roll. Hey, you just want to jump in this. Look at it. It's a little fancy. She's even like, wow. How can I eat that? Aren't you a good girl? Who's a good girl? Who's the good girl? <laughs> jump. Up. Jump. Oh, up. Come on. Jump. Up there. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Avalanche. <laughs> oh, she's so jacked all the time. All right. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> oh, crack me up, Nulls. Come on. Three and four by four. A little breezy, eh, Noah? And here the sled's coming down the road. River's all frozen up. Truck's all washed. Put her on marketplace. See if we get some bites. I'm sure we're gonna have some haters. Oh, I hear a dodge. There she is, the shredder. After a year of sitting, she's good to go. Take her for a spin. Holy frick, it's windy. No, I was like, what is? 
We're good. All right, we just unloaded it real quick, but of course it's frozen solid. So we're gonna take the Maverick for a rip while this thing thaws out. And maybe take it for a rip later. Ready, Noah? Mm -hmm. See what she's got. Take her for a rip. Show us some donuts. Oh yeah. Way better now. A Segway with tracks. A lot of fun. Definitely highly recommend it. We're supposed to be coming out with an electric one this year, so I am excited for that as well. Hey right, Noah, you wanna go for a rip? You bet. And it does well in snow too. You just can't. Fill it full of snow like that and then stop because the snow does melt and it kind of bugs it up. So as long as you clear it, the tracks away. Apparently the muffler was hanging off too. I got a steering fix, doesn't seem to want to go left. I don't know if a bolt fell out or what. Alright. Uh, she turns right good though. and good to go. What's up guys? I totally forgot to end the video <laughs> in the garage. I'm hitting the sauna now to sweat out the weekend. So this is the pool room. Lots of echoing. Oh, whoo. So yeah, happy Connor fixed up the shredder. 
doesn't turn left for some reason, but he said it didn't turn left when he first got it. So he tried to figure it out. Didn't really know what's going on, so I'll take off the board and see if I can adjust under the seat there, or under the board, the little turning mechanism. We'll figure that out, but glad we got a full weekend video made. Hopefully we'll figure out a sled this week because it's supposed to keep snowing and stay cold. You know, February is the month, so let's figure out a race sled and see if we can uh, cause some controversy with it and film some crazy videos. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't do anything we wouldn't do. If you have any suggestions, let me know and uh, have a fantastic day. We'll see you later. Bye.